Hello everyone, welcome back to another video. Here I'm going to be showing you the release of my Dead by Daylight config editor. Let's start things off by getting a fresh config out of the box and showing you what this can do. Alright, so here we have it. This is Dead by Daylight as if you have just installed it for the first time. So we're going to get pop-ups about all of the events, we're going to get pop-ups about crossplay and behavior accounts. So this is how you know this is a fresh config. And as you can see here on the top left, we're being used about 47% of our GPU. If we check the options, it's defaulted us to ultra settings. And yeah, so we can use 47 to 48% as our base reference. I think 47 is the most part here. So We'll use that as our reference and now let's jump into the config editor to see what we can do. Okay, so let's start things off by showing you that this really does make a difference. So we're going to start off by pushing the graphics as far as possible by using the cinematic preset. All it takes is one click and we're ready to rock. So let's jump back into Dead by Daylight and we'll see if anything has changed. Once again, we were already on Ultra, and this is going to take us even further. Alright, so we are now in after using our config editor, and I can already see a huge increase in graphical quality. You might not be able to tell because of the YouTube video compression, but if you can't tell, then here is the hard evidence. Our GPU is now pinned at 99% usage. Just from one click, we have pushed the game to over double. If you remember before, it was on 47% GPU utilization, and now we're on 99% utilization. But I'd imagine that most of you want more frames, not less. So let's make this game run way nicer. Let's start off by putting everything on low instead of ultra, and you'll see that our GPU is now sitting at 57%. So we'll keep note of that and we'll jump back into the config editor. Okay, so we're back in the config editor now and we want to get as many frames as possible. How do we go about doing that? Well, let's start things off with something that I know you guys will love and that is the uncapped frame rate button. One click, boom, we now have VSync disabled and we get more than 60 FPS in game. I know many of you really wanted that, so you have it. Now, let's pretend we're rocking a very, very bad system that can barely run DBD and we're willing to make any sacrifice we can to get the best frame rate. Well, let's just start off by clicking the performance preset once again, one click, and we can jump back into DBD to see what is going on. All right, so we're on the game once again after using our config editor, and you can obviously see a huge decrease in graphical quality. This looks horrendous, but on the bright side, if you look in the top left, you'll see our GPU is being used even less. It was at 57% and now it's at 39% and we're getting double the frame rate. That's right, we're getting double the frames at half the GPU usage. That is a huge difference already. Now let's jump back into the program for a moment so I can explain some more stuff. Okay, so this does give you the ability to fine tune everything. There's a balance preset as well if you want good performance but without it being disgusting and it lets you customize each setting individually as well as your 3D resolution. And I've also given you guys an additional goodie as we can adjust the sensitivity in game. As you know, it's normally between 100 to 0% sensitivity in game for both mouse and controller. Well, this lets you go from 0% to 1000%. Yep, you can go up to 1000% sensitivity on both mouse and controller using this program. All it takes is one drag of the slider to any value you want, click apply, and boom. So let's go, let's set our killer mouse sensitivity to 500% or 500, you know what, no, we'll go 1000, we'll go 1000%, in fact, we'll go 1000% on everything. Actually, whack this up to 1000, just, just to show you it works, we'll go 1000% sensitivity in game. And just to show off the balanced preset, we'll use that as well, one click, Let's run the game. All right, we're back after using the balanced preset and changing our sensitivity. Our GPU usage is a little bit higher now because we're at the 120 frame mark, but let's jump into the options and check our sensitivity in which we will see 1000% sensitivity for all four options. There you have it guys, there's my Dead by Daylight config editor. The program is completely free, the link is in the description below. If you're going to use a config editor, then be sure to leave a like on the video and come stop by on the Twitch stream, twitch.tv slash Arditha. We're live every day on 12pm UK time. Don't know where to go, might lose control over every single thought of my heart and my soul. Getting ripped to be depart like I do not know what isn't isn't right, so I unroll. The demons get a hold and they change.
change my mold, leading me into a realm that remains unknown. And ahead of me, the blade like an old fell road, and the meter with the bodies that are up below.